The motor company's $700 million investment is gearing up for the release of the all-new F-Series Super Duty truck. It will be revealed tonight at Churchill Downs, and that's where WLKY's Alexis Matthews joins us now live with all the details. Alexis? Well, Jennifer, Vicki, Ford's announcement, the unveiling of the truck that will happen later tonight, and even a limited edition KFC bucket are all a part of Kentucky Day, highlighting Ford's long-standing history here in the Commonwealth. So in honor of Ford and their continued belief in our people, in our workforce, in our ability to make the best trucks on the road, Welcome to Kentucky. <laughs> September 27th is now proclaimed as Kentucky Day. It's a tribute by Governor Andy Bashir to Ford's century-long history as the largest vehicle producer and employer in Kentucky. Here in Louisville alone, they employ about 13,000 people directly. Their operations here have helped create about 120,000 jobs across Kentucky. That economic momentum is expected to increase as the motor company is now investing $700 million in their Kentucky truck plant here in Louisville. It'll be used to update equipment at the facility and add 500 new employees to produce the new 2023 F-Series Super Duty truck. For those in the labor union representing auto workers, the creation of new jobs is always a reason to celebrate. We know that uh, as technology brings new vehicles and EVs, uh, sometimes that reduces the numbers. In this case, sometimes it can, it can add numbers. The investment adding to Kentucky's leading role in the automotive industry comes exactly one year since Ford announced it was bringing a $6 billion electric vehicle battery plant to Hardin County. It's very important as we build these products and our future products right here in America and we bring our suppliers in as close as we can because we're about quality, safety and production. And with this being one of the largest contributions in Jefferson County, leaders say the impact will not only be felt at Ford, but throughout the communities the company serves. It's one thing to have a big plant here. If you're not loving on your community, the community doesn't understand the benefit beyond the economics of what they do. And in line with Kentucky tradition, the Super Duty truck will debut here at Churchill Downs, home of the Kentucky Derby at 715. Live for you this evening, Alexis Matthews, WLKY News. Thank you, Alexis.